Hello grade 5, please open with me your revision sheet, question number 51, which is based also on grammar. We started with the grammar and we have finished 10 questions, so we will complete answering some other questions. So, page n question number 51, which word or phrase correctly complete the sentence below? Teddy, what have you space today? Have will take the past participle of the verb. So it will be ate, eaten, eaten, eaten. Of course, it will be eaten. Underline it. Let's move to number 52. Which word or phrase correctly complete the sentence below? Julie's little sister space last night. So number fifty-two it will be cried, cried, have cried, has been cried, without crossing. So it will be number fifty-two. Cried because it's last night. It means it's the past tense. So, underline cried B. Number 53. Which word or phrase correctly complete the sentence below? Yesterday also. Mr. Rappel space away all of the trash after the picnic. In the past, it will be through, throwed, throwed, thrown. It will be through because it's an irregular verb so the past of throw it's through let's move to number 54 which word or phrase correctly completes the sentence below i space that i had the correct answer so here i knew known know have known it's in the past so it will be i knew so the past of the verb know it's new so it's an irregular verb number 55 which word or phrase correctly complete the sentence below my twin and i space everybody when we dress the like so here number 55 is it going to be surprised surprised has surprised, have been surprised. So it will be surprised. Actually, surprise, it's a verb that ends with E, so we will add only D to form the past tense of the verb. So it will be surprised. Let's move to number 56. Which word or phrase correctly complete the sentence below? Yolanda space me a cup of juice. So it will be Bringed, brought, has bringed, has brought, have brought. So we will, will take brought because the past tense of the verb bring, it will be the irregular verb brought. And then number 57, which sentence is written correctly? Let's read together. After talking about the plot events of the movie, comma, we discuss the characters. B. After talking about the plot events, comma, of the movie, we discuss the characters. Let's move to C. After talking about the plot events of the movie, we discuss the characters. After talking about the plot events of the movie, was discussed semicolon the characters. So, which one in which sentence in number 57 is written correctly? It will be A. Because here we have after subordinating conjunction and then the depending clause, and then we have the comma, and then we have 
the last clause it's the in independent clause so we will underline a o a is the correct answer then let's move to number 58 which sentence is written correctly can you please pass the carrot comma Robert can you please pass the carrot semicolon Robert can you please pass the carrot at the carrots Robert can you please pass the carrots comma and then open a quotation Robert close the quotation and then the ending mark so which sentence in number 58 is written correctly so if you are calling somebody you ask the question and then you make a comma and then you write the name so it will be can you please pass the carrots comma Robert it means that Robert is uh, Robert is standing in front of you let's move to number 59 which sentence is written correctly while comma Mrs. Ozomo comma checked out my books I opened my backpack or B while Mrs. Zomo checked out my books semicolon I opened my backpack or C uh, while Mrs. Izomo comma checked out my books comma I opened my backpack or D while Mrs. Izomo checked out my books, comma, I opened my backpack. Actually, the correct sentence will be D. While Mrs. Izomo checked out my books, comma, I opened my backpack. Why? Because here, while is the subordinating conjunction. And the sentence after, uh, after it, immediately, it will be, it's a dependent clause. And then we write comma, and then we will write correctly the independent clause. So underline with me D. Then let's move to number 16 and 16. Here we go. Which sentence is written correctly? Really is playing to is planning to join us, isn't he? Or really is planning, comma, to join us, comma, isn't he? Really is planning to join us, comma, isn't he? Really is planning to join us. Some semicolon isn't he? You remember the question tag that I explained? We said that it's as a tail of the sentence. And we use it at the end of the sentence to make confirmation about something. To make confirmation about something. So, after writing the sentence, we put comma and then we add the question tag. So, it will be C. Really is planning to join us, comma, isn't he? And then the question mark. Let's move to the last one for today. Which sentence is written correctly? Raccoons, semicolon, squirrels, semicolon, and snails live in my backyard. Raccoons, comma, squirrels, comma, and snails live in my backyard. Raccoons, squirrels, and snails, comma, live in my backyard. Raccoons, squirrels, comma, and snails live in my back yours. So which one is written correctly? If we said we said that if we have serial of words, we make comma comma and so it will be B raccoons, comma, squirrels, comma, and snails live in my back yard. Underline. Like that we have finished eleven questions based on grammar. See you next time to finish the whole sheet. Study hard. Goodbye.